In the little town of Van Wert, Ohio near the Ohio-Michigan border, there's an enterprise called the Eisenhower Manufacturing Company with a tradition of thinking outside the box. The company got its start during World War II supplying the military with bogey wheels for army tanks, while today it manufactures specialized precision stampings of all kinds for the auto industry. And between 1946 and 1957, the family-owned firm developed a most unusual prototype truck it called the Eisenhower Freighter, featuring twin engines, eight-wheel drive, and three steering axles. The first truck constructed at Eisenhower's experimental shop in 1946 was based on Chevrolet 1. Five-ton truck components two complete new trucks were disassembled for parts, reportedly, including their engines and drivetrains. While never commonplace, twin-engine trucks were sporadically built for extreme-duty applications in the 30s through the 50s. High-output diesel engines were still relatively expensive and unproven, and a pair of conventional gasoline engines was seen as one alternative. Only one prototype truck was actually built, and it carried the cargo box above, with a rated capacity of 20 tons. Thanks for watching.